you and your husband, you were 27 years CIA. He was 52 years. That's he was 25 years. That's combined 27 years. How is it being married to a CIA agent where both of you are CIA agents? Perfect. Is it really? <laughs> it was and it wasn't because we under we each understood yeah. what the other one was doing, but we still couldn't necessarily talk about everything we were doing. So I know um, I was. Uh, I never say where I worked. I can't say where I worked. I was in the subcontinent. I came home. He had a conference. He said, tell me about that thing you're doing. This is my boss. He's my boss back then. I said, well, I can't tell you. Who, your husband was your boss back then. He wasn't my husband. He was just my boss. He was two tiers up, my boss. He said, tell me about that. I said, I can't tell you about it. You're not on the list. You know, I told him later, if I had known I was going to marry you years and years and years later, I would have maybe told you. <laughs> you told him that. So do you trust him? Do you trust being married to a CIA agent? Like, because they know they're a pro like you as well. How do you handle that? That's really one of the key questions when you're working. Yeah. It's one of the real compliments you can give a colleague. You can say, I would work with you. I would work with you. You know, we go off to far flung places and, and where there's, there's really no support and where everything you need, you have to have it with you. You have to pack that bag. You have to trust that person to, to have your back. Mm -hmm. It's a very symbiotic kind of relationship to say, I trust you. I would work with you. It's a big deal. We would lie for a living. So there was this thing called a moral compass. We used to talk about it because we lied <laughs> for a living. But when we weren't working, you couldn't do any more lying. How you do know, you know the difference? Though? You know, that you had to make sure that you kept those two things separate. It's important that you kept them separate. Yeah, that's what I wonder. I mean, it's some of these, you know, Aldrich James, some of these, these, these no good nicks that we had working for us, they just lost their way. They really lost. If there was ever a line for them, they, they lost it.